We were driving through New Hampshire and came through the town of North Conway and we just had to stop for a little bit. It's cute. It's got everything. It's got donuts for me. <laughs> we're out on some hiking trails right now that are just all over the place. The mountains, they're they're jagged and they're beautiful. Coming from the western part of the U.S., this is the first place we've seen on this side of the U.S. that has things that we'd actually call mountains. <laughs> True. When I was younger, I really liked to ski and this has the charm of a little tiny ski town. I said, tell me your story. It's snowing. He took out a notepad. And wrote something for me. Walking on down the road And I watched him disappear like smoke And I thought I'd just seen a ghost And I looked down at what he wrote Oh Bridget, we found your store! I said, son, when you grow up you'll be fine now you've got questions on your mind Life is gonna happen one way or the other Whether you like it or not Stop looking for the answers I love New Hampshire. The mountains, the rivers. It was beautiful and the people were really nice. I really want to spend a couple months during the summer there just hiking the trails. And that White Mountain National Forest oh, and Mount wow. Washington. Absolutely stunning yeah. mountains up there. Definitely want to go back. Let's we'll spend a summer there. Yeah. <laughs> Loved it. That is Lake Champlain. We are in Burlington, Vermont. The whole state is just so picturesque. The college is beautiful. There's lots of oh, yeah. old buildings. Now we're going to drive along the water. All right, walking along the chilly shores of Lake Champlain, well, <laughs> is chilly, so off we go. We're stopping in the ski town of Killington, Vermont. And you'll find what you've got. There are so many of these old covered bridges all over this area. They're just gorgeous. And this one's really hardy. Wrote in my story. We're wandering through Woodstock, Vermont, which is listed as the quintessential charming New England village. I have to agree thus far, although almost every place we've been in New England has been really charming. You can tell it's a new day because we got new shirts on. You've been wearing that shirt for a week. <laughs> then I kept walking on down the road. When the time is up, it's time to go. We were just reminiscing about like what our lives used to be like and how much they've changed. Our old lives were great, but this new one is so much fun and I love it. I wouldn't trade the life we have now for the old one for anything. No, uh-uh. And our old lives were great. Yeah, we, we still have all the wonderful friends and everything, but it's exciting now and we get to see so much. We may be eating peanut butter and jelly sandwiches every once in a while, but I wouldn't change that Lots. for the world. Well, yeah. <laughs> and now currently living on rice and canned chicken. And every once in a while, I have been getting a couple donuts from Dunkin' Donuts, because you know, they say it on the East Coast, this is what you do. <laughs> I mean, we've been eating the rice and chicken twice a day, and I haven't gotten tired of it yet. It's really good. It does make me want to head back towards Asia, which hopefully we'll be doing soon, but that kind of depends on things that are outside of our control. Yeah. So we'll just enjoy where we are for the moment. <laughs> we did see a moose. Unfortunately, he was down on the side yeah. of the road. 
but we saw a moose. <laughs> and we just saw a porcupine walking across the road. Oh yeah, that was so funny. I've never seen one walk so delicately across the road before. Even when we have things planned out, it's become clear that we have no idea what's coming next, so. No, because half the time we get there and we're like, oh, well, this isn't what we thought, or oh, this is so much better. Or, you know, there's a global pandemic. With everything, I still wouldn't change this life for anything. Yeah, me either. Yeah. It's awesome. Mm. And I have a wonderful partner to share it with, which uh, is... As good as mine. <laughs> which is the incredible part. <laughs> awesome. Love you, Anna. I love you, too. I pray he reads what's on the wall And takes to heart what I wrote One of the things I love about New England, New England is the granite pillars. They're beautiful. Love is gonna happen one way or the other, whether you like it or not. Stop looking for the answers, then you'll find what you've got. When you grow up, you'll be. Well, Woodstock gets a thumbs up. You on Vermont 107 West for three miles. I just told her that, Cortana. Could you be a little more original, please? Oh my God, I almost just hit an otter. <laughs> but you didn't. But I didn't. He was so cute. He was. He was moving. He was really trying to get off the road. Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>